compared to all the other parks, there's more glaciers in Wrangell St. Elias than there are anywhere else. And so keeping track of what those glaciers are doing is really important for understanding the impacts of glacier change on the ecology of the park, on the physical aspects of the park, like river flow, and where the glaciers and the rivers flow into the ocean. All of the glaciers in the park discharge meltwater. Most of our glaciers terminate on land and then they discharge their water into rivers, which are of course habitat for most notably salmon, but lots of other fish species for aquatic invertebrates, for all sorts of different organisms. Those rivers behavior is sort of dictated by the glaciers. Glaciers in the park are changing in a lot of different ways. Every glacier is different, but the most prevalent form of change in the park, as it is elsewhere in Alaska, is that the glaciers are shrinking. And the impacts of shrinking glaciers on the park are really multifaceted, the most notable of which is, is the rise in sea level that's associated with turning all that glacier ice into water that then flows off into the ocean. <laughs> 